They had a really good winter in AK. Just got a call from Vladi. We were gonna go to Alaska. So we arrived in Juno. We decided to spend a couple of weeks there. We hooked up with uh, Mark, the the guy that uh, that uh, Vlad uh, knew for a long time. After one and a half week, we just had this heli heli day. My first heli day actually. Just fly around with the heli like in AK, like one of the most beautiful place on earth, I would say. It's just amazing to fly over the glacier, over the mountains. Uh, we saw directly a wind leap with pad that looks pretty cool over like a crevasse. And it was a really good session. I stomped my first track and Matt did, so Matt did the second try. So that was the, the best uh, beginning we, we could expect. We tried to get another spot right next to the other one. I, I tried it in the front side tree, landed, but I went like bigger than expected. And that was it, first day of Hali in AK. We heard it was really good in Haines. So we just decided to go to Haines with the camper. Took the truck, the sleds, then just left. <laughs> We're like 90 feet long. Just found a nice place next to the road before the Canadian border and we, we made our base camp over there for one week. <sighs> Ready kids? Mm. Oh yeah. Man, this place looks nice. Oh, yes! <laughs> There's quite a journey to the Haines Pass this year. Oh yeah. Well, uh, it would be nice to ride something quick. Yeah. Like that we don't need a lot of shape, you know? Well, yeah. that to give us the motivation. Like, like, uh, like this, like, for example? This after like 10 days of waiting, yeah. So yeah, this is the best. Yeah! went to this crazy lines that Matt tried and <laughs> almost killed himself, <laughs> so I didn't try. That's probably the most beautiful place I've ever been in my life. There was like nothing around, just the road, the camper, us, the grill. So we, we were really <laughs> stoked to be there after two weeks of not really riding. The, the trip in the in the RV was uh, really good. We had uh, almost five five sunny days in a row, so we went out every day. We were cruising with the sled, like trying to find spots, and then we just found this natural lip on the at the end of the of a chute. Then we started hitting it a few times with Matt. He got a few good things. And I was trying a cab nine. I almost landed it like three or four times, and then the last time was probably the worst bail I've ever, I've ever had. Just went straight on my head, like so bad. And then it just, I thought I broke my neck first. <laughs> At the end, it was nothing too bad, so I'm pretty stoked.
What do you think, Mark? I think it could work. You did a natural quarter pipe? Yeah. We just found this natural quarter pipe. And first I, I just like tried it, natural, and then I sh shaped it a little bit just to do a good training. Just realized we could go really high on, on this thing because it's like a half pipe actually. I did this backside rodeo zalu. I was really stoked on and also tried a frontside 1080 double flight. Yeah. So it was really like riding pipe. Yeah. Just training for the Olympics game. That's the Olympic game training right now on track. Sachi. It was just perfect and then we hit it a few times. Matt tried to. I really want to thank Absence for taking me up there in Alaska. That was a really, really good experience. 